And I hope that, you know, this cow's face draws you in. This is what I go for. Cows have long been a staple of Western art, just not how Elsa Soroka paints them. I've been experimenting with cows on couches. Barns have that Western feel to them, too. This piece in particular is here in Colorado. This is down near Jamestown. But Stephanie Hartzorn never thought of herself as a Western painter. What I love about the Coors show is that we, it's, it's not... It's not this traditional, classic Western show. Both artists say this year's Coors Western Art Exhibit is expanding what we think of as Western art. It's how a lot of the artists are interpreting the West now. Maybe that's why it wasn't easy to get an answer to the question, what is Western art? <laughs> well, I can't say I've really given that much thought. Yeah, that's a really good question. I don't know, just more in touch with maybe nature, the roots, the land. Native wildlife and, and uh, Western themes. Obviously it's the theme, but there's kind of a, a, a natural dimension to it. It could be one of those things where you just know it when you see it. It's an interpretation of our past. Or maybe... This isn't really Western and it's in this show. It's a cow on a couch. Brian Wendland, 9 News.